Julia Kunjeku. I'm 12 years old and I am in grade 7. It was different because you see it's it is an adventure but it's an adventure that give us a, it give us a very big lesson. Cool. And do you have a favorite chapter in the book that you like most? No, I don't because I liked all the chapters. <laughs> <laughs> and do you think the book should be published? Yes, I think it should be published because not it's not only for children but for grown-ups also. It also gives lesson to everyone. Every chapter, every chapter I read, it made me want to read another chapter. My name is Antonio Sokrujo. I'm in grade seven R and I'm 13 years old. And did, did the book lose your attention at any point? No, it was just fantastic. Uh, how would you compare this book to other books you have read? Of all the other books that I've read, I think this one is the best. Do you think this will make a nice movie, the uh, story? Yo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when Mrs. Parks, Mrs. Anthea Parks gave me the book, um, I told myself I'm going to read five chapters each day. But then the, the way I was so excited, I read, I read five chapters and then I wanted to read more than five chapters, like to chapter six, chapter, chapter seven. Simply amazing all the challenges that our learners face and choices that they may have to make every day and what I bring forward in my lessons to them as a librarian is crammed into one book. Endless courage and honesty. I can go on all day if I have to. The book should be published because not only for the learners which can be brought into their life skills lesson in the classroom and of course in the library but the parents as well should read it because that book is an example to us as parents as edu and educators the book is brought out it's portrayed in the characters for the learners to learn and to stay on the right track